Join me for Trash to Treasure Thursday as I show you how to make some really inexpensive and super easy bowls for your dolls. Alright, today we are going to make some little bowls. Now in the dollhouse these could be punch bowls. We're actually going to get a colored one and a clear one out of each of our little items. Uh, these could be salad bowls, they could be big mixing bowls. They're about an inch in diameter so that would translate to about a foot in diameter for a bowl. So that gives you an idea. I have a great big mixing bowl that I use for salads when we have company sometimes that this kind of reminds me of. Um, but this one I actually learned about secondhand. A friend of mine that I'm on some of the Yahoo groups with asked me if I would saw a post by another gal that's on there named Tanya. Tanya, if you see this, hi. Uh, I'm stealing your idea. I hope you don't mind. Um, Tanya is a master at going to places like Dollar Tree and finding things that work in miniature. And sometimes it's things that I've looked at a dozen times and all of a sudden Tanya's got a picture online that she's made something wonderful. So what we do, this is how I'm doing it. I haven't even seen her pictures. I just went down and bought them and thought, oh, I see what she must have done. So I, if I'm butchering your project, Tanya, I'm sorry. But what I did... And I found some of these come apart a little easier than others. I'm using my wire cutters to kind of just break this outside rim on these off. I think I forgot to show you what we've got here. I'll show you in a second. Get a container because you're going to have a mess. And luckily Dollar Tree items are not glued together very well. Because what we've got here, let me get that off in a minute. These are from Dollar Tree. They're little baby rattles. They're in the baby shower department. So for a dollar at Dollar Tree, you get six of these. Six rattles will give you six clear bowls and six col colored bowls, which I think is awesome. <coughs> now, for dollhouse size, punch bowl, large mixing bowl, something like that, but if you go Barbie size, they would just be a large bowl. They'd be about a six inch in diameter bowl. Or if you do American Girl, all of a sudden we've got like a cereal bowl. And these are perfect for little doll sized cereal bowls. I'm going to try and paint some and use for that. But that's all there is to it. So for $2, I actually have two dozen bowls here, which I think is a great deal. Let's see if I can do another one here. And we'll see. I haven't figured out anything to do with the little plastic bits that come in the thing other than maybe put them into a cooler and use them as ice like in a mini cooler. Wow that piece just shot all the way across my office and hit the wall. So be careful when you're doing this to um, not hit anyone with flying plastic. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. Luckily no one's standing over there. All right. So, and some of these are glued a little bit. It's like they kind of, they must have heat sealed them or something. Oh, this is probably really ruining my nails. All right, so. There we go. Might need a little emery board to kind of even that up a little bit. But we've got some trash to treasure bowls for the dollhouse. I hope you enjoyed this trash to treasure project. Check the blog post uh, for any more details. Be sure and join us on Facebook because we have a lot of fun over there. And come again next week and see what we do then. 